and out here. Okay, game. I was gonna steal all that. Got some good pieces. Damn. Out I don't want to wait another two days to be able to make shit. Let me know if you see anything you like. Yeah, I want steel ingots. You got yeah, any? Every... Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Nope. I'll take those actually though. Maybe we'll have to make some stealing. It's oh me. Yeah, boy, what? I don't claim to have you met my father, the finest weapons and armor. Don't forget to check inside the shop. I just... I need one more Corundamore and one more Iron Ore. We've got some... The finest weapons and armor. Damn it. Good doing business with you. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm flipping through talking to her because I'm talking to her so much in these, like, little few minutes. I help my father in more ways than people do. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta run. I gotta run to Yorlin. Hopefully he has I can run to more. Do you get to the cloud district very often? No, I don't. Shut up. I'm not I don't have much chill for you, dude. I run out of stamina so fast, I hate it. Yo, a lot of steel. you got that good shit? Raised. Yes! Mm -hmm. No! 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 Not make the mistake of making a fucking corundum ingot. Stamina get glitch, you could run forever. I, I don't want to do that. All right, boom! Nordic battle axe. All right. No, 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 no! Get the fuck out of here! I'm here. It goes up to 91. It's not as good as Wu Thread. Not as good as Wu Thread, and it's legendary. Wu Thread flawless is 111. Well, that was a wasted piece of shit. Oh well, we'll sell it for decent money. Mm -hmm. Gods be praised. All right, take that. 
we done? Yeah, all that for nothing. Well, that was the battle axe. We have this and this. Now, this is 139. That's 124. Uh, question is, though... Don't have any. God damn it, you're. I. I. I'm fucking. I just. Mm. <laughs> there needs to be a mod where you can access all merchants at one spot within all of Whiterun. Please. Just for 91 damage? Yeah. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters of some real authority written. That'd be a good mod. Yeah, exactly. You just look, you could just do it right here. You could just walk up to this thing, and then all you'd have is like books or something. You know, and each book would be a different shop for each city. You know, in each city they'd have one of these where, you know, a book would for each shop and you would just like kind of place an order. And then a dude would show up and hand you all of the, your your orders, like, you know. Someone needs to make that some right now. Take a look. Like a delivery, exactly. She's got thirty-one corundum ingots, but fucking Yorlin didn't even have one. Don't forget Bastard. to check inside the shop if you need anything. Okay, so the the steel plate armor is 133 while the nordic carved armor is 139 so the nordic shit was worth making have you met my father Take the nordic armor the weaponry wasn't really so, um to be fair uh Wuthrad is really good now because it's technically like a Daedric fucking artifact or something like that. It's on that tier. You can try to make a, uh, a mod like that. I have the Skyrim creation kit. It's pretty easy. Dude, do it. I'm an ideas man. I'm not one who, you know, carries out the ideas. I like to make the ideas. I help my father in more ways than you think all the I'm curious. my father provides Yarrow fucking... is alone? Let's just say I advise the advisor and leave it at that. I just want to buy I'm things. Waiting. Take a look. I'm too. I am too. I'm waiting for you to allow me to buy things. I'll take my leave then. All right. Oh. Need something? Well then. I'm waiting. It looks like we're wearing dwarven Looking armor. To protect yourself or deal some damage. Too bad so sad for fucking Nordic shit whenever dwarven armor is hella better right now. I'll take my leave then. Um Yes. Two steel. God damn it, I need two steel. Alright. Wait in two days. Cause I feel like this battle this dwarven battle axe might kick ass. It might kick ass. Um, I'm actually gonna go for like five four minutes while I go move something for my grandfather, because if I don't, he's gonna like pull out his back. Mr. Granadus, thank you so much for the follow, man. I love you. I will be right back in like four minutes. I'm sorry. That Got some good pieces out of here. Bye.
Okay. Thank you so much for the follow. I mean, the hosting enchanted. <sighs> All right. I'm gonna wait another 24 hours for her to have a new fresh inventory. Blacksmith in White Run, Yorland Greymane's got that honor. Man, please shut up. Legendary. All I ask is a fair Just, chance. I want to give you money. Have you met my father? He's a student. Oh my of the god! Dragon. Spin around, do a jump, step to the side. I help my father. Let her Yorland lean on the post. People. You think? Hmm, blades. Now helmets, she can fucking pretty much sell me shit. Oh my helmets. god. No steel. One of the most basic metals that there is, and yet she has no steel. Like, she never has steel. We've got the finest weapons and armor. If so, let me get steel. Oh my gosh, thank you. What did I need, like, three? I needed, like, one iron. Good doing business with you. How many dwarf in... Oh! Keep going. Oh, I can't... I can't push it up any further that way. Um... When trading with the same race? Well, that doesn't help me at all. What's this? That's pretty worth. Welcome back. I'm gonna save that. Uh, we have... You look no like me. Dwarven. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? Which I think we need... I'm gonna just buy all of it. I don't give a shit. Until next time. The Dru Drudak Mountains form the natural border between Western Skyrim and the provinces of Rock and Hammerfell. That is the that's the mountains that Bolton went through then because he came from Hammerfell per our roleplay lore. Oh man. Oh man. We're halfway to killing the stream boss, which is me. I'm waiting. This is not the thing that I'm supposed to be at. Oh, what a Fucking wow, not even as good as the Nordic battle axe. Yes. I figured since the armor was better, take a look. Oh, that's right, the ancient knowledge only affects the armor. Damn. Okay, I'll sell you a hammer. I don't know where I got it from. Until next time. 
All right. What can we do? Let's go to Meridia's Beacon. Damn it. Gotta use the carriage. Expansive hot springs and volcanic tundra dominate a large section of East March Hold. Remember that you have to do that quest? I can take got it a while back, but I didn't want to do it because the fucking mage at the end is pretty fucking strong early game. And I didn't want to get destroyed because he uses the frost storm. Oh my gosh, the dwarven. The dwarven boots are the only thing that I, you know, I'm like, ah, uh, can I change him out? Because Dwarven Boots just look like fucking Uggs. For YouTube purposes, since that took so, such a long time, I'm gonna have to um, do a thing. So, there we go. So, uh, I'm gonna be cutting the uh, the parts out that uh, I will be doing smithing and all that other stuff that takes a long time uh, for YouTube. So, what we did was we ended up making a bunch of armor and running around a lot. Uh, doing enchanting and um, alchemy, uh, what we ended up getting after completing Avanchella's or whatever the hell uh, you say it, uh, we had the dwarven armor and the dwarven helmet. We ended up making the dwarven boots and gauntlets, turning all of these to legendary because they are actually upgraded all the way. They're better than the Nordic set. Um, the Nordic armor was 139 and the dwarven here is 149. We ended up putting. Um, Weapons and armor improvement enchantments on all of these because I figured that um, since we're going to be getting the increased uh, experience gain, might as well put the improvement stuff on it. But it turns out this will be our main set of armor now. Um, we need to put that on for our thing. We still have these ebony boots that we stole. Um, we made the plain giant backpack, I'm pretty sure, just there. Uh. We we tried out some other um, battle axes. Why did it drop? I don't know why the weapon damage for this dropped. Um, but Wuthrad um, was higher than uh, the Dwarven battle axe and the Nordic battle axe, which we made. Uh, the Nordic Battle Axe came up to, like, 91, and Muthrad was 111, but now it's dropped down to 104. I don't know why, um, but there's that. Uh, nothing else, really, that we did that's worth noting. I mean, we used up a lot of our ingredients to make potions that we ended up selling a lot of, not really keeping many. Um, and there's nothing else through all of this. Uh, we added some skills in. Uh, I'm pretty sure that one of the skills that we added while we were doing all of this was this one. The ramming speed. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Uh, can perform a two-handed sprinting power attack that deals up to 50% more damage and critical damage to a target above half health. The higher its remaining health percentage, the more damage and critical damage it's dealt. So pretty much whenever we first encounter an enemy at full health, we can do a running uh, a sprinting power attack. 
right towards them and do super damage that might just one-shot them. Um, we placed um, this into alchemy, so that way whenever we drink a potion that helps us, uh, we get 2% of our magicka and stamina back uh, per second. So pretty much for 30 seconds. So 60% of our stuff comes back within 30 seconds, so just higher regeneration rate. And we're saving this last perk um, for something. I'm not sure yet, because I don't know what I want to place into it. Right now, we're heading to... Um, we're heading to uh, do Meridia's Beacon. So we're heading here along Solitude uh, to... Um, does this change it now? Now with Red is 125, that I have it equipped. Probably because now the rings take effect. Um, we're heading to her... Is that is that her temple? That is her temple. Look, see right there. That's the statue. Why is there a thing there? I heard it. I heard it. There it is. Go away. Is there two? That's the only one we saw before. Is that a combustion dragon? I think that's the only one. Greetings, brother. I think it's a combustion dragon. Weary. I have something to help Fucking you relax. creep. Take a look. He's fucking selling skooma and moon sugar. Mm -hmm. uh, you got any skooma? Fucking guy. Should put this away so I can run farther. Yeah, that's her temple. These fucking flag things flapping in the wind make me like. Look at my temple lying in so ruins. Weird. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. If they it's not really fair. Out, how can my love reach them? Innuendo. Ah, uh, here we go. I'm gonna get the first word of my favorite freaking shout collection. We're going to go and unlock that right freaking now. Now, I am curious. <laughs> We can put it on with red. Because his enchantment is an enchantment, it's a weapon effect. There's a difference. Me, my beacon, that I might guide you toward your destiny. Ungi. Place the magic ball. That looks like a dice ball from a uh, fucking... Like Dungeons and Dragons, though. The it's twenty-one. Time for my splendor to return to Skyrim. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple. Now, yeah, what sucks is I can't again. see Dick though. <laughs> the this would give such a great like view, but snowstorm. <laughs> Lost souls left in the wake of this war to do his bidding. 
worse skill. He uses the power stored within my own token to fuel his foul deeds. Now we're gonna fuck I him up. I brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the defiler. Okay, so Bolton roleplay lore right here. He sees himself as a guardian, and Meridia, Meridia, even though a Daedric prince, hates this necromancer, and so does Bolton. Bolton despises necromancers. Um, so, he is absolutely going to side with, with Meridia and take out this dude. Of course you will. I have commanded it. Go now. The artifact must be reclaimed and Malkarin destroyed. Malkarin is gonna get. Oh, Malkarin oh, has son. the door shut. But this is my temple and it responds to my decree. I will send down a ray of light, guide this light to my temple, and its doors will open. Am I going down now? Bye! If you guys don't have the Old Kingdom uh, weapon overhaul mod, I can't wait for you guys to see what uh, Dawnbreaker looks like. It looks amazing. <laughs> 